This video is about getting an introduction to Bootstrap. So let's start with the most important question. What exactly is Bootstrap? Well, in Bootstrap's own words, Bootstrap is the most popular HTML, CSS, and JavaScript framework for developing responsive, mobile-first projects on the web. But in a nutshell, what Bootstrap is, is it's a set of classes that are defined inside of CSS as well as a set of functionality that's defined inside of a JavaScript library. Now the functionality that Bootstrap provides could absolutely be built on our own. So the question then becomes, well, why actually use Bootstrap? Well, the first big reason is that CSS can be a bit tricky. Trying to figure out how things are going to be applied, how to order things inside of your CSS file, etc. All that can cause confusion. The second thing is that cross-browser support can be a big challenge. Gone are the days when it was simply Netscape and Internet Explorer. Now you have got Microsoft Edge, you've got Chrome, you've got Firefox, you've got Safari. And not to mention all the different mobile versions of those different browsers as well. So trying to make sure that you can target all of those can be very tricky, especially as you try to use scale up and scale down into mobile browsers. Doing the simple things inside of HTML, CSS, JavaScript, like maybe popping up a modal dialog box, which is very easy to do inside of Windows, is not built right in when it comes to HTML, CSS and JavaScript. And so that's where bootstraps come into play. Bootstrap is designed to make all of that much easier. So Bootstrap is going to give us a whole set of features, things like themes. It's designed to be responsive, so it will automatically scale based on device size. It will give us a layout with a grid, so we can avoid using tables. It will give us some cool components as well. Now just to kind of dig a little bit into some of the different Bootstrap features, you are going to notice that we get a responsive layout built right in. So that way it will automatically scale based on the device type. So that way I get the full blown page as you see over the left hand side. Over on the right hand side, when we scale down to a phone, you will notice that everything scales down automatically for us. It also comes with a whole host of different components. So if you want to be able to pop up a modal dialog box, or if you want to set up paging, if you want to set up cool buttons, or if you want to set up tabs with pills, you have the functionality available to you. You have also got a set of little icons called glyph icons that you can use. So if you want a little user icon or a little checkbox or a little X, you have that capability built right in. Okay, so this tutorial is going to be a series of videos where I'll be taking up the various components of the bootstrap framework and explain it to you guys practically. If you have any issues or comments, please leave it in the comment section below and I'll see you guys in the next one.